it's great to have you on Humans of Data Science. Before I ask you a couple of questions, would you mind to please provide a brief introduction? Hi, everyone. My name is Megan Silvey. Um, I am a student at the University of Kansas, so I'm studying mathematics right now, and I will be graduating this upcoming fall. And so I've kind of been uh, working on my mathematics kind of at school, but I've been learning to program and kind of do machine learning and everything um, on my own. So I've gotten into this data science world and I've really been connecting a lot with people on LinkedIn and the community and just really learning as much as I can. Okay, great. So the first question I have for you is where do you, where do you want to work after you graduate? I think you're graduating end of this year, calendar year. Yeah. Um, there's not any particular companies that I would want to work at, but I would love to go to the um, Pacific Northwest. So like Seattle or Portland or just a little bit different culture and atmosphere than Kansas City, Kansas, where I've lived my entire life. All right. So data science, what, why are you interested in that space? What draws you to it? So I've always had a passion for mathematics and statistics in particular. And I love how data science kind of takes that job of a data analyst to the next level of kind of implementing more predictive analytics and machine learning and kind of artificial intelligence. And I just really love kind of all the aspects of data science, but I also love how it's a continual learning process that way you never really get bored with your work. So I'm definitely looking forward to kind of that aspect. Hmm. Okay, very interesting. So quick question. So you're still in school. Um, what would you say that you're most proud of? What was your biggest achievement so far? Um, probably my biggest achievement is becoming president of the KU Math Club that we have on campus. So it's we just started it last March and it's really been interesting just kind of being with the club from its start and seeing it grow and just learning kind of as a president of a club like having fun at the meetings, but also learning kind of that leadership aspect and, you know, putting these meetings together and reaching out to different people to come speak to us. And it's definitely a lot of different aspects that go into it, but I'm very proud of kind of achieving this, but also being able to really provide our members a really good set of meetings. Great. That, that's a huge accomplishment. How do you become president of something like that? Um, I attended all the meetings. I definitely showed my interest. Um, we had kind of one of those typical elections with ballots and okay, our, very cool. I guess majority vote kind of rules in that sense. Um, but yeah, but I just kind of shared my interest with Bath Club and said that I was very dedicated and that I'm, you know, looking forward to seeing where our club goes in the future since it is relatively new. Okay, very interesting. Um, so the last question I have for you is outside of school and work and data, what else do you enjoy doing? Um, I enjoy doing a variety of things. I always love spending time with my husband. So sometimes we'll go out to the local amusement park or maybe we'll go swimming at the local pool. So I like doing that and swimming in particular is one of my really big passions of just I've swam for years and years and years that I just feel like a fish when I get in the pool. So yeah. I, um, and then I also really enjoy music. So I grew up pr playing a lot of instruments and I kind of like piano or saxophone, things like that. Um, but I also still enjoy listening to like music in the car or going to local concerts or anything like that. So that's kind of what I like to do in my free time outside of the whole data science. <laughs> that's very cool. Uh, what kind of saxophone, the alto or the tenor? The alto. Me too. I played it all through school. I that was awesome. I play guitar now. <laughs> I try to play guitar now. <laughs> yeah. That's cool. All right. Well, thank you so much, Megan. This this is very interesting and very good to know you. Thank you. Yeah, thank you so much. It's been awesome getting to talk with you a little bit and just kind of sharing a little bit about myself.